spinning back fist. That one hurt. Go. Look at this. He's got him right here. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg. Inside leg. By Lee. The kick gets oh. through. the walk such a well-rounded fighter and you got to think when the opponent breaks him down on film not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video this is a true mixed martial artist may not stand out in any one area but plus skills across the board probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight this guy is a very well-rounded fighter he does not mind standing or going to the ground and this diversity makes him very unpredictable for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Ben Mergliata. And now, this is the moment you all it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing folks, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds, fighting out of London, Ontario, Canada, Assassin. Good thing it is in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, your back to your corners. Come I am front. very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go ready? down right ready? now. Let's go fight. All right, so this UFC Grand Prix tournament is coming up next. This format has been all the rage with a lot of the hardcore mixed martial arts fans out there. Sort of an homage to the history of UFC and Pride with a single night tournament game event here. And let's see who can be the last man standing here tonight. Nice leg kick, very nice. Trademark inside leg kick there by Lee. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, Lance flush. He's gonna have to make some adjustments here moving forward. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Lands the kick to the body there. Joe, pretty good head movement to slip that right hand. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Oh, that's a good strike there by Lee. And he connects with the punch. 
Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, spinning fast fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. but missed. Here's a powerful leg kick. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Very impressive striking going on in that round. All right, let's get him some water. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen, you're doing absolutely well. Brittany Palmer doing fine work as usual. Second round underway. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys got rocked. If they continue at that pace, someone's going to sleep in this round. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Lee. The kick gets oh. through. Oh, he tagged him to the left. This could be it. Some real power shots here. Oh, big left. Well, I know he's confident in his chin, Joe, but he left his head wide open for that returning hook there. He would be wise to start moving his feet, get on the tips of his toes, and figure out a way to get that head off the center line and out of harm's way. Cut, but fell short. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. These guys are exchanging huge shots. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Effective punch there by Lee. Trying to pass. On top in half guard. Lands with the right hand. 
Ali's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Good elbow there. Less than a minute to go in the round. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Ooh. He lands a huge elbow to the head. Now he's got the mounted crucifix. Oh, big shot from the top. That's oh. it. He's out cold. Ground and pound KO. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound, and it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight, and that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next, and ultimately the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. Here it is one more time, and he's out. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory that could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliana has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 29 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room.